Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. Derek reacts back at it again, and you read right. Kim Wilde Patreon request said I should check this one out for Patreon week, and I can't wait to get my hands on this one. Taking it back to 1986 with uh, "Keep Me Hanging On." Um, I believe I've heard the Supremes version, um, and not this one. I'm kind of confused which one I've heard. It, if it was this one, or or the um, the 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 Supremes version. There's so many different covers out there, guys, of this song, um, and it's very popular. But we're going to be taking a look at the official clip um, made possible by you guys, and I can't wait to get my hands on it. Before we get into the video, please take a moment, comment, like, and subscribe. I would love to hear your feedback. Makes videos like these all the more possible. And also, take a moment to follow me and like me, both on Instagram and on Facebook. And if you're new to the channel, guys, welcome. I also have a Patreon link down below. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. Makes recommendations like the one you're about to watch all the more possible. And if this one gets approved by me, guys, it's going to go straight on my Spotify. Be sure to follow me there at Derek Reacts. Um, where you can check out my playlist for all Derek React approved songs. Uh, link in the description down below. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go. Oh, so good. So good. Guys, the instrumentation to this baby is sick, and it's nasty. It's coming in so good, so good. Right from the beginning, you get all those little synths, all those little guys back there coming in so nicely, um, making this baby stand out. Stand out. Once you hear it, you're like, oh, it's, just, it's that song. It's that great song. Um, and setting up the stage for something big to come with her fabulous vocals, as we know. She's so good. She's so good. So rocky. So rocky, but also synthy. You hear the synths. You hear that bass. That bass is killer. It is killer. It is smashed. Oh, my God. Everything, everything coming in. So good, guys. This is classic stuff. Classic stuff. Um, and it's a cover. And boy, she's doing it justice. Boy, she's doing it justice. I think I've heard of the Supreme Supremes version before. Um, I'm not sure where. I'm not sure where. I know I've been reacting to Supremes lately, but um, I don't think I have that reaction in by them. But I've heard it somewhere. I don't know where. <laughs> It's different. Why don't you play? I like those. Come on, smash, smash. Oh. That bass is amazing, guys. <laughs> oh, oh, drums, drums, drums. Guys, this is going to come at you. It's going to come right at you. coming right at you most definitely oh yeah oh yeah love how they use the shadowy figure there the silhouette in the back kind of like symbolic to uh to the to the person she's referencing to uh she's singing about notice the lyrics and what, what the song is all about set me free why don't you babe uh, get out of my life why don't you babe it's it, basically just like using her using her for whatever it is um maybe for like all the tangible things or not only that just uh 
you don't really love me. You don't really love me. You just keep hanging on to me. You keep hanging on, um, and it's by a thread. It's by a thread. Um, you don't really need me. You just keep hanging on. So being used, used for what? This isn't this isn't real love. This isn't true love. So good these lyrics. These lyrics are so good. But it's just, it's just the, the, her take on it too. The the rock take that she's she decided to take this on with the synths. And I love the ooze, the ooze and the woes. I love all those things. So good on that. Um, this thing is slayed, guys. It's slayed. You get the keyboards coming in nicely. The synths coming in nicely. By the way, bass. Synth generated, synth generated bass, um, and then your guitars and all those things, percussions, the drums, all those things are so good, um, making this one a standout. Oh, get out, get out, get out. You hear the keyboards? Love it. And notice the guy is there. He's in the back. The shadowy figure. He's there. Um, it's so good. But it's it's really interesting because you listen to these lyrics. I mean, this stuff is so real. You still you say you still care for me, but your heart and soul needs to be free. Your heart needs to be free. You need to move on. Get on with your life. You don't you don't really want to be here with me. Um, you just you're hanging you're hanging for whatever is left of us. You're hanging on to it. Um, you still want to hold on to me. Um, uh, because it's probably so convenient for the other person, right? For 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 whatever circumstances they're they're in, um, she's the one probably doing the deed correctly. She's probably the one doing the deed correctly, but he's just uh, kind of just hanging by a thread and just let letting the wheels roll. If you know what I mean. You don't want me for yourself, so let me find someone else who really, who really truly loves me for for everything, for everything, and the correct manner and the correct way. So good, guys. And it's dressed up in this nice number. Ooh. Come on, girl. Yeah. Get out. Get out. <laughs> so cheesy. Guitar strings. A lot of guitar strings. This is such a good one. This is so good, guys. So good. Nothing absolutely wrong with this whatsoever. I mean, I can't find anything wrong with it. She sang her 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 bananas off. She sang her bananas off, and um and the song itself is good. The song itself is good. This baby has been covered so many times. Um, let's let's go right through it. Um, American rock band Vanilla Fudge released a cover version. Uh, the following year. Um. And it re reached re reached number six on Billboard Hot 100 um, after after the 1966 version by the Supremes um, reaching number one on the Billboard Hot 100. Um, it was written and composed by Holland Doiser Holland. So there you have it, originally. And in 1996, country singer Re Reba McIntyre versions reached number two. On the U.S. Billboard Hot Dance Club, I, oh check her out. She's got a dance version to this. BBC ranked the Supremes original song number seventy-eight on the top one hundred digital Motown chart, which also ranks Motown's releases by their all-time UK downloads and streams. Um, and then Kim Wilde herself, the one we just reacted to, nineteen eighty-six. Guess what, guys? Number one, number one, Billboard Hot one hundred in June nineteen eighty-seven. So this song has been very successful amongst many different genres, right? 
but also different artists. And that goes to show you that when you have a well-written composed song, structure and everything like that with a nice chorus, you can take this baby and put it in different genres and, and people can sing the heck out of it and, it's, and it sounds good. Um, and then it went to back, it went back to, um, in the first 32 years of Billboard Hot 100, 100 Rock Era, the You Keep Me Hanging became one of the six songs to reach number one in two different musical acts. Um, and there you have it. So good. So good on the ears, guys. Uh, everything that was, was, on uh, uh, instrumentation wise was just completely slayed. Um, and it was the second single from Wild's fifth studio album, Another Step. Uh, the first single has been released in selected countries, though the single reached number two in, in Wild's native UK. She's from out there, guys. She's from out there. And number one in Australia. It also became second to the last top 40 uh, entry in the U.S. following Kids in America, the one we just did. That was a fantastic one. Um, as well as her most successful song to country to date, reaching number one on the Billboard Hot 100 for a week, for one week, um, in 1987. It's ranked as the 34th best-selling selling song in 1987 by Billboard Hot 100, um, and that year. Certified Silver by BPI, um, with UK sales of 250,000 copies. And there you have it. And she actually performed a new version of the song um, in 2006. So there you have it. There you have it. Very cool video, too. Very cheesy, but it, it gets to the point. It's very simplistic. She's in bed. She can't sleep at night. Um, and when she's singing and she's up, she's singing about this man that's in her life and hanging hanging by a thread and you just using her, using her for everything. Um, and she just can't have it anymore. She, she just she wants to be free. Set me free. Move on. Move on with your life and, and let me love the, 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 a real man that wants to be... Um, loving and, and actually do do the deed correctly um and then you see all this all these papers and everything kind of like just when she says get out of get out of my life and the door is there you know you leave and everything the the door is open and all this paper goes flying through and then you see the shadowy figure there so a very very fun video um for its for, for today's i i guess you know i mean it's just it's just 80s cheese guys that's how it is that's how it is um so good, so good, guys. So good, so good. Um, please leave your recommendations and uh, your comments down below. I'd love to hear what you have to say on the next Kim Wilde uh, song. I have got a couple, couple, of, couple of them floating around. I want to know what you guys think down below. All right, guys. Until next time, for more videos like these, guys. Take care. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more videos like these, be sure to check this one out. And also, take a moment to comment, like, and smash the subscribe button to stay on all of the distraction videos. And, guys, yes, I have a Patreon link. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. Makes recommendations like the one you just saw all the more possible. All right, guys. Take care. Love you guys. Peace.